Flames hosting the Sharks, and the Sharks are plus 275 on the money line. The Flames are minus 350. The over-under, five and a half goals. The Sharks getting a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 108, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Flames laying a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 130, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. It is supposed to be Blackwood and Markstrom in net tomorrow, but they haven't been confirmed yet, and the Sharks are playing a back-to-back. They were in Winnipeg tonight. Head-to-head, the Flames are on a five-game winning streak. They are 6-4 and four against the Sharks in their last 10. The home team's won the last two, but the road team is 7-3 and three in their last 10. The favorite is on a five-game winning streak. The favorite is 6-4 and four on the money line, and the favorite winning these games by multiple goals, laying a goal and a half, is 6-4. and four. There's only been one one-goal game in their last 10 against each other. The over is 6-4, and four, and the over at 5.5 goals is 7-3. and three. They have not played each other yet this season. The Sharks are 1-3 in their last four. There was a total of seven goals, two goals, five goals, and then one goal. Two goals and a loss, two goals and a win, two goals and an overtime loss, and then they were shut out tonight, 1-0. For the Flames, they are 4-1 and one in their last five. There was a total of five goals, eight goals, seven goals, and two goals. Four goals and a win, five goals and a win, five goals and a win, and then they were shut out and a loss the last four games that they played. They were on the road. I'm going to take the Flames with the money line. I will take the Flames laying the goals, and I'm going to go under in this one. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.